Hey everyone, this is Jeff Chan from MMA Shredded, and in today's video, I'll be showing you nine tactics used by Conor McGregor. If you like this video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. First tactic is slipping or leaning back against the cross of an orthodox opponent and firing back with a cross. Connor either slips without moving his feet or he steps to the side as he slips. Connor hits this on Jose Aldo, Nate Diaz, Eddie Alvarez, and Ivan Buchinger. Here it is in sparring. You can apply this tactic off the jab of an orthodox fighter if you are an orthodox fighter yourself. Harder to time because your opponent will not commit to the jab as often as he would throw in the cross. And here I try it in an orthodox stance against a southpaw stance. And here I try it in a southpaw stance against an orthodox fighter. And here are a few that I was too slow to counter. It's okay to practice and look for the slip counter during sparring, but make sure you be careful for the head kick. Tactic 2, the lead hand corkscrew uppercut followed by a cross. When Connor throws the corkscrew uppercut, he steps outside of his orthodox opponent's lead foot to create an angle, and then he follows up with a cross. Connor has been seen using this against the following orthodox fighters, Max Holloway, Dennis Siever, Eddie Alvarez, Chad Mendes, and Nate Diaz. Here it is in my spine. And here I try it in an orthodox stance against a southpaw stance. Tactic 3 Lead Leg Shuffle Sidekick Connor uses this against Eddie Alvarez, Max Holloway, and Dennis Siever. Connor stands in a wide stance and almost a bit sideways. He then shuffles, his rear foot then replaces his lead foot, and his lead foot becomes the weapon to strike. Here it is in my spine. Tactic 4, Lead Leg Shuffle Heel Kick. With the same footwork as Tactic 3, Connor goes up high and kicks his opponent's head with his heel. Connor attempted this against Dennis Seaver, Max Holloway, and Dustin Poirier. Here it is in my spawn, although I never actually landed it. Tactic 5, spinning sidekick. To execute this, Connor steps forward with his lead leg, pivots and churns to launch his rear foot into his opponent's body. Connor uses this against Chad Mendes, Diego Brandao, Dennis Siver, and Dustin Poirier. Here it is in my sparring, but I use it in an orthodox stance. Watch it, cause it's shocking, dropping, I'll be stopping. 
Tactic 6, the spinning heel kick. The same footwork from Tactic 5 is used, except Connor heel kicks to the head. Connor uses this against Dennis Silver, Dustin Poirier, and Diego Brandao. Tactic 7, the rear uppercut hook cross counter. Connor backs up against an aggressive pressuring Marcus and launches the rear uppercut hook cross. Connor is seen using this counter to finish Marcus Brimage. Here it is in my spawn in an orthodox stance. And here it is in a South Park stance. Tactic 8, you've seen it in my video on Sanchai, the rear leg scissor kick. To execute this technique, step forward and push off your rear foot, lifting your lead knee up to fake and scissoring your legs to throw the left high kick. Connor uses this against Dennis Seaver and Max Holloway. Here it is in my sparring. Tactic 9, the rear push kick into a jab cross. Connor uses this against Eddie Alvarez and knocks out Chad Mendes with this combination. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, please comment below, subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram, and subscribe to my mailing list in the link below for exclusive content.